the things that we definitely won't put as the background. <laughs> uh, Falcon can absolutely get destroyed off stage by Kirby. Not only that, but Kirby is so tiny. He's a little boy. He can he definitely die to a knee any day. Right? <laughs> oh. oh my god. Oh my that's god. what I'm talking about though. Like that situation, like a, a, a little different of that same situation and you can die for it. Oh no. No he needs tech. To tech those. He needs to tech those. What was that? Oh, he missed the up B. He neutral bead. Oh, man. That was actually a What was that shield error. pressure? Well, one thing is that Kirby down tilting, like, dodges so much of Captain Falcon's options. Yeah. He's just too close to the ground. Although, I think, does side B now hit Kirby if he's crouching? I think I just saw it. Did. It did. Oh, he read the spot dodge, but didn't actually punish it. Yeah, he didn't punish the the uh, the side B, waiting for the spot dodge read, and then didn't get the punish. Oh, and like this is one of the other things about Gatsby and the way he edge guards like that is that you need to basically put all of this distance between you. Yes, fine. Gentleman killed, but I, it shouldn't have. That was bad. The eye, but. But um, like when he goes deep like that, you have to fade back in order to not get hit by him. At which point, anyone comes to the stage, and he still has the opportunity to edge guard you. Yep. Yeah, he did that long lingering sour spot uh, knee hitbox. Got teched, but it still like ate all of these unmarked jumps. Ah, yeah, he wanted that down air, but in that situation, I feel like he's he's hungering for the down air when he doesn't need it. When neutral air maybe could do. You know what I mean? Have you met Gatsby? That is absolutely. Oh no, I'm talking <laughs> about. I'm talking about Gmail. Oh, Gmail Mark. Oh, okay, I see what you're saying. I mean, yeah. No, I mean, what you think Gatsby's not gonna go <laughs> for the down air? That's good. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, good game one from Gatsby. That's a matchup that normally Falcon can't struggle in. Yeah, I, I, I think he still does well in it, but like. The I fact that Kirby has, it feels like he has specific tools that counter a lot of the normal things that Falcon likes to do. So the fact that Gatsby is just playing around that so uh, expertly. Space, space away from him, make him overextend into you, and then uh, out of shield punish. Yeah, Stuck. and recognizing when he can out of shield yep. punish, because we saw all of that pressure, but for the most part, he wasn't necessarily getting all these like, aha, now I caught you jumping, and you got up tilted for like 80 damage. Did that back here do 16%? What? That back? How did I never know that back air did that much damage? You're dead. And by you're dead, I mean you're fine. <laughs> no, no, I, I like that. I like that. It, it, like, I like that because Gatsby has been coming back with aggressive options the whole night. It's like, it's like I go off stage, but I'm gonna jump back to stage, and you have to deal with that before I'm not gonna do it. Oh man, Look at, this is kind of where Falcon can start to struggle. The Kirby pressure and the fact that, oh man, this isn't even necessarily like Kirby things happening. This is just John Mark playing brilliantly. Oh and, man, that was, that, that, that was so poor. He actually got the jab block and missed the F smash yeah. and, then, and then got killed for it. I wonder why the F, that's the second time he's missed the F smash off the jab block punish. And yeah, just take 51 bro. That's a good trade. Keeps him away from the uh, worst of it. And that's the sort of thing where Gatsby goes for that upbeat, but he also, it feels like he only goes for it when he's certain he has, like, at least one or two escape options. You know, whether there's a platform there or a ledge nearby, or just some way to make it even that much trickier for the opponent to punish it. That was so good, the spacing! Never mind, he it was did. terrible. I mean, he's at 158. I mean, obviously, you want to hold on to the stock, but you also try to want to make something happen off stage. That air dodge was beautiful. That was like max spacing. And that's the second time we've seen that down B kill while uh, John Mark was trapped in the corner. Ooh. Oh man, here comes the grinder. John Mark still struggling to land. Gatsby just being on top of him. These counter attacks are just whiffing. Finally, one lands. Let's see what John Mark can do with it. Actually, a lot. He's keeping the pressure on. Oh no, he didn't, he didn't do the conversion off the trip. He got a trip and he reset the trip situation by down tilting again. Whoa! Yeah, yeah, I, I knew for a fact that that up smash is not going to connect. I think you have to be jumping in order for that up smash. That's going to be it. 
Yeah, and there it is. Gatsby, despite taking a really early uh, loss in that game, runs it all the way back and manages to win the set.